I have to do this pretty quickly as well because I can't afford to be wasting wasting any time because it might lose me the game later. I also can't afford to mess mess up that giant big wally target. Come on. He just wrote this in. Where are you? You're in there somewhere. First, they made me consider running two of the dang things. Because I'm such a pain looking for it. However, that's inherently horribly not optimal. <laughs> oh, so, can't really do that. Drifter here. Cards. There you can buy. Three win. Be a good start. If I see so. Four hoppers. A little bit of time. What's that? Hey. More time. Afford to spend some of these flickers. He's not going to interrupt this at this point. Just getting uh, cards. Just actually having to put those particular abilities on the stack because usually you go in there by default. Flicker, demonic wall, and we are back on this train. Okay, also research fine. Heard some of these cards. Really, no. A lot of fairies. A lot of fairies. That's called a fairies. This deck is absolutely silly. It's it's absolutely ridiculous, and it's also really consistent. So, just uh, a really good deck, which is the problem. Oh, thank God it's here, finally. Ooh -wee. Wait, is he going to make me go through the, the rest of this? 51 goes to 49, 47. Forty-seven. Forty-five. Forty-three. Forty-one. Thirty-nine. Sorry, I'm not saying much. But this is a very crucial part. Make sure I do every bit of this as fast as possible. 37, 35, I think. Untap. Tap. Return. 
see, 33, 31. Usually this part takes around two minutes. Cards he's got left in case you weren't paying attention. 23 goes to. Oh. 21, 19, get it. Client's going slow today, so there's all these like hang ups that aren't that weren't here the other times I was running this tech. Seven, five, three. Alright, one more. Should be should do it. There is a fail safe in case something goes wrong. But um That should be it. We'll get it back just in case. Like care. Yep, yes. Let them resolve. And also research on you. Oof. Yeah, twin is nothing compared to having to play this one out. Okay, so Kiln Fiend, I probably should have looked at his deck. Figure seems really good here. GOP Red is really good here. Repeal is actually pretty good here, as well as our Hydro Blasts. Really dislike Seagate's Oracle, even though they're Seagate Oracles, even though they're kind of essential. I'm not sure how much of this I need to bring in. Give me your thoughts, guys. I'm uh, gonna update the, uh, the record while we do. We are one out so far. Pyroblast out of the sideboard. Good point. Let's see what you guys were actually saying. Zero realistic outs out of Kiln Fiend. Could snap Kiln Fiend pass and take another turn, which made like five minutes. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, I'm just putting putting stuff on the board. Yeah, that's a, that's a good point. Um, I'm just not used to doing it that way, and usually it doesn't take that long to draw in. I'm not sure how much I need to bring in here. I think Hydro Blast is just better than Disfigure here. Um, what else, though? Of he's really good when comboing off. I'll probably just bring in uh, three Hydro Blasts. I'll need Reaping the Graves, but... Here's the inherent problem with this deck, is you just need all of these cards. I don't like COP, but if the game goes on, it seems good. All of his ways to deal damage are red. <laughs> his Kiln Fiends... Yeah, it, he just has no way to win. I mean, I can just hit him with flyers at that point. I would be overjoyed if I got a, a Circle of Protection in my opening hand, but I didn't. So this is still fine. Oh, he's got a Delver. All right, forgot they ran that. Oh, for a second, I was playing a different guy. Okay, so we're just evolving wilds. We're gonna get a black. Play a familiar. Play a familiar. Hope he doesn't. Anything out of here? Oh goodness! Do not like the start. I guess I'm gonna drop the sunscape from the layer. Mm -hmm. 
I need to get up to be able to play that Mole Drifter. Hard cast. I'll be able to block. Yeah, circle of protection and just win matchups. I actually forgot about the Delvers. But Bull Drifters can get in the way of that if he can get him down in time. Well, that's what I'm gonna try and do. So next turn, I'm gonna land a familiar. Maybe compulsive research just to sort of look for stuff. Discarding Swamp. And then turn after that around Mole Drifter. Oh goodness. I probably need to hold up Hydro Buff for that. So never mind compulsive research, sorry. Or if he, well, he probably has Pyroblast. Flips, no flips, no flips, no flips, no flips. Ah. Ugh. So what do I? He has a Pyroblast. I guess I let him get it. Hmm. I think I gotta try for it. Three blocks. Chance he can do something about this. Okay. okay. At least it would have been a quick game. I don't know why it gave me that option. Okay, so I can compulsive research and mold drifter. I'm gonna do that. I need more cards. Oh, thank god, a snap. I don't want to do that. I can just snap. Yeah. I'm just going to go ahead and snap now. Then I'll be able to compulsive research and play Mole Drifter. I'm just going to... be real helpful. You'll want the uh, blue mouse. Start casting Mold Drifter. Hope he doesn't kill it. Let's kill it. At least I've got these worthless cards. Get in there. Don't kill it, 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 don't kill it. Swing into it. You know you want to. Make the trade. What if I flicker it or something? That'd be awful. Please. I'm, I'm tapped out. Got a chance to kill it. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Now he knows what's up. But presumably that means he doesn't have another Kiln Fiend or other things. So he's just looking to think whether he wants to kill my Mole Drifter, I think. And he sees that I have no, no flicker type stuff. So he's not too worried about me flickering that in response to him killing it later. But I could still draw into it or get it back with mnemonic walls, so not really sure what he's what he's gonna be doing here. Hopefully losing. I hope he loses a lot. I hope he casts like I hope he casts nine more Gitaxian probes and just loses. Because that's possible. Gushin? Okay. Okay. Something. I guess he's looking for the removal. Yeah, because this his deck doesn't run a ton of removal. Runs like seven or something. Brainstorm, dig in. Cool. Because I can mnemonic wall and get back snap and snap his other aberration. Wait, he still has a Delver in hand. What he's doing? Did he play land already this turn? Yeah, he did. It will take that trade all day, sir. Get that thing out of here. Oh, maybe you can give it first strike or something? Or mutagenic growth. Um, that's actually fine, I think. Because that gives me more time to be able to answer it. As I said, I can mnemonic while getting back snap, so... Cool. Nice. Yeah, we'll do what I just said. I want to compulsive research first. No, 